for us to find the slope given two points on a line. The slope of a line is equal to the ratio of the rise to the run, which equals the ratio of the vertical change to horizontal change. To find the vertical change, we need to find the change of y, which is the difference of the y coordinates, and to find the horizontal change, or the change of x, we need to find the change in the x coordinates. So before we use this formula to find the slope, though, let's look at the graph of the line passing through these first two points. The point negative five comma negative two is this point here, and the point nine comma negative two is this point here. Notice how the line passing through these two points is a horizontal line, and a horizontal line always has a slope of zero. Let's go ahead and verify this by using our slope formula. To keep things organized, let's call this first ordered pair x sub one comma y sub one, and the second ordered pair x sub two comma y sub two. So the slope m is equal to Again, y sub two minus y sub one would be negative two minus negative two divided by x sub two minus x sub one, which is nine minus negative five. Simplifying, negative two minus negative two is equal to negative two plus two, which equals zero, and nine minus negative five equals nine plus five, which equals 14 and zero divided by 14 is equal to zero. So the slope of the line passing through these first two points is equal to zero. Now let's find the slope of the line passing through the second set of points. And again, let's go ahead and plot these two points on the coordinate plane and sketch the line. So the point in negative three comma negative eight is this point here, and negative three comma negative nine is this point. Notice how the line passing through these two points is a vertical line. Remember, the slope of all vertical lines is undefined. But again, let's go ahead and verify this by using the slope formula. So again, to keep things organized, let's call the first ordered pair x sub one, comma, y sub one, and the second ordered pair x sub two, comma, y sub two. So the slope m is equal to y sub two minus y sub one is negative nine minus negative eight. Then we have divided by x sub two minus x sub one, which is negative three minus negative three. Simplifying, negative nine minus negative eight equals negative nine plus eight, which is negative one, divided by negative three minus negative three, which equals negative three plus three, which equals zero. And remember, division by zero is undefined. Verifying, the slope of our line is undefined. But notice how for a question, when the slope is undefined, we're asked to enter DNE. And therefore, we enter DNE. And again, we already found the slope of the line passing through these two points is zero. I hope you found this helpful.